Hi, I'm Jeff Murrah, and I want to welcome you to True Texas History, where today we're going to deal with the question of who was uh, Bernardo Gutierrez. Actually, his full name, let me read this, this is a long one, Jose Bernardo Maximiliano Gutierrez de Lara. Uh, <clears throat> I chose today because today is the anniversary of when the Gutierrez McGee expedition went ahead and crossed the Sabine into Texas. Now, uh, Gutierrez is uh, one of those characters that uh, loom large in Texas history, but many times we uh, ignore uh, or his accomplishments have been pushed to the sidelines. Um, of course, Gutierrez was born, uh, oh gosh, back in 1774, and uh, he was born in uh, Tamalupas State uh, of Mexico, and, and he was always involved in trying to gain the independence of the Mexican people. At the time, it was against um, the Spanish forces, and he and his brother, uh, found themselves uh, aligned with Father Hidalgo in his efforts to gain Mexican independence. And they spearheaded the revolutionary efforts there in Nuevo Santander, which is uh, the next state down from Tommy Lupus there on the coast. Um, uh, that was unsuccessful. Um, but um, they did, it was successful in the sense that they uh, were able to arouse the people. He also recruited along the Rio Grande and uh, ended up influencing the Las Casas uh, revolution there in San Antonio. Uh, now, I also did a video on the Las Casas episode. Uh, that's one that uh, you may want to go ahead and read because, you know, people uh, forget about... Um, some of the things that happen in San Antonio and, you know, people's heads being put on post and things such as that. It's uh, part of Texas history that often gets ignored. But because of these things, uh, Gutierrez was seen as a rising star along with um, Hidalgo. Now, the Hidalgo, uh, he was eventually caught and executed, but Gutierrez made, uh, did make his way to the United States. And, and he gained quite a bit of notoriety because he was the first Mexican official to uh, actually uh, reach the United States uh, and advocate for Mexico. Um, now, in terms of his involvement in the intrigues associated with the Gutierrez McGee expedition, I do have a video on that. I encourage you to watch it. Um, this time, I want to focus just on uh, Gutierrez because uh, after the uh, Gutierrez McGee expedition didn't work, he maintained close relations with many of the filibusters and he was involved in uh, the Long Expedition. Uh, this is a man who fought at uh, the Battle of New Orleans. He was approached by another group uh, aiming to uh, go and attack Pensacola. Now, at that time, Pensacola was still under Spanish authority um, and to uh, relieve it and turn it into part of Mexico. He ended up being uh, a representative of John Michael Ari. Uh, which was a pirate uh, stationed down there in Galveston. Um, so you find uh, Gutierrez uh, involved in many of the uh, attempts at uh, Texas independence along the way. Um, and eventually he was uh, elected uh, governor. And uh, the only problem was that was... Uh, a little bit before the time of the Texas Revolution, uh, now uh, with the Texas secession uh, and the success of it, uh, there were some uh, people in Mexico that wanted to go ahead and uh, create another uh, free and independent state, the uh, state of Rio Grande. Uh, it was not successful, but it posed a threat to Gutierrez at that time. Um, and uh, a Texan by the name of Ruben Ross uh, led an expedition down into Mexico and actually protected uh, Gutierrez. Um, and he ended up dying uh, and was buried uh, under a church in Saltillo. 
But uh, he's a fascinating figure uh, who played large uh, in Texas history uh, and international history. I mean, the man uh, met with diplomats from Russia, uh, France, England, uh, all over. Places that you never thought would have had an interest in Texas, but were very interested in Texas. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any comments, feel free to leave them below. I welcome any thumbs up. And uh, until next time, this is Jeff Murrow wishing you via con Dios, my friends. Goodbye.